you've alluded to that in some of the beautiful hadiths you've mentioned just now, but um, what specific reason is it that Ramadan is called the month of forgiveness or is known as the month of yes, forgiveness? Yes, as I rightly mentioned earlier, that our beloved Prophet Muhammad said, it's in a hadith of Sahih Bukhari, Ram number three, book of fasting, hadith number 1901, our beloved Prophet Muhammad said, that if anyone fasts in the month of Ramadan with the proper intention, with faith, and asking for reward of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will forgive all your past sins. And this message is further repeated in the Musnad Ahmad, volume number three, hadith number 11524, where it's mentioned that any person who fasts in the month of Ramadan with the proper intention, seeking the reward of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will have all his previous sins atoned. And further it's mentioned in Sai Muslim, volume number one, hadith number 450, our beloved Prophet Muhammad said that the time between the five prayers and the two Jummas and from one Ramadan to the other is the time for expiation of your sins. This is the time where you can have all your sins forgiven. And our beloved Prophet Muhammad also said, it's mentioned in Sahih Muslim, verse number four, in the book of Tawbah, hadith number 6644, our beloved Prophet Muhammad said that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, at night time, a person who asks for forgiveness, he forgives the sin for the sin he has committed in the day. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, in the daytime, he forgives the sin for a person who asks for forgiveness for the sin he has committed at night. So this is the best month of forgiveness, the month of Ramadan, where you can easily have your sins forgiven because the gates of heaven open and the gates of hell are closed. Therefore, it's called the month of forgiveness.